So, uh, here, let's just, uh, let's retry from the last checkpoint and retry this again. I'm gonna step on the gas. Going in hot. Going in hot. We're coming in. Coming in hot. Coming in. Launching missile. We got a hit. Target destroyed. Three to go. Continue to engage in your discretion. Firing. Coming in. Step it on the gas. Thirteen hundred. C-17 
17, not far. Head for it. Again, the C-17 out of the sky. I got hit. Oh, 
one of the toughest things I've ever done. Dark Star is right for takeoff. Dark Star is right. Air superiority by destroying their radar. The first barrier keeping us from retaking the space elevator is gone. Now is the time to group up and begin the counteroffensive. Let us reclaim what is ours. All right, y'all. Next mission. This mission, I'm gonna be flying in a good old, probably fifth planet fighter. That's our briefing. The surprise attacks carried out after the declaration of war saw the peacekeeping forces of various countries, including Osea, suffer major damage. The ships moored around the space elevator and near Dandar Bay have been hit particularly hard. Numerous ships have been sunk and abandoned. Fortunately, our cutting edge aircraft carrier Kestrel 2 was at sea, so it was spared for the attack. Kestrel 2 is now preparing to launch another attack against Arusia's capital, Farbanta. The aircraft carrier Vulture also managed to escape Gandar Bay safely. However, it lost all its aircraft, so it's sailing empty. Today, the International Union Peacekeeping Force reclaims its bid to the space elevator. The Fort Gray's Island Air Base Squadron will rendezvous with the carrier Vulture for a joint mission. The first objective will be to seize air superiority in Tropenberg in order to secure a route for the support squadrons. The enemy maintains air superiority in Tropenberg, so expect heavy resistance from enemy aircraft. There's more, so listen carefully. Right from the start of the war, the enemy has been deploying drones. They're using a new, advanced type of drone. The unmanned airborne aircraft carrier, the Arsenal Drone, carries this new drone, MQ-101. The Ocean Army headed up the development of the massive Arsenal Drones and dispatched them to the space elevator to provide support. However, it's been reported that the carriers may have fallen into the hands of the Erujian forces. If that's true, it could be a significant obstacle for us. We need to regain control of the space elevator ASAP. Good luck out there. Let's get ready. This time we're not doing this the thing.
We're the fifth generation fighter. With um Sorty. New squadron aircraft preparations complete. Operation Dual Wheeler. Refueling initiated. Maintain your current position. Refueling? Squadron, this is the situation. Gollum and the other bases squadrons already joined forces and are engaged. You guys will arrive right in the middle of the action. Mage Squadron, eliminate all bandits in the current airspace. We have the upper hand, but that doesn't mean we can ease up. Good luck. Mage 1, Wilco. We have F-16s. Mage 1 to Gollum 1, thank your lucky stars. Looking good, Mage Squadron. Keep up that pressure. Trigger time to show the other guys that we just went wild. Going through. Once you hit one of them, stick to them like blue. Don't let them out of your sights, even in the clouds. And so you're going to be coming in with backup. Go ahead.
combat. It's a bogey. It's a bogey. Gargoyle, 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 Gargoyle,
orders. Be ready for your next sortie. Mage Squadron, this is the situation. Gollum and the other base squadrons already joined forces and are engaged. You guys will arrive. Anyways. Unfortunately, the two-front offensive was a failure. The aircraft carrier Kestrel II was sunk during the attack on Farbanti. Carrier-borne aircraft mistakenly bombed urban areas, and this has turned public opinion in neutral countries against us. Our own forces also suffered heavy losses. If it weren't for a few extraordinary fighters, many of us wouldn't have made it home. The situation is grim. We have precious little time, however. We have to get to the space elevator. Okay, y'all. Sorry for the no talking that I've done for the past like, 30 seconds now. Here he comes. Um, I really enjoyed this game. So I'm gonna end up here if you liked it. Well, like and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time.